come, 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 snipe. <laughs> There's a snipe. I would say I'm six foot. <laughs> Look at that gaping. Look at that gaping now. Mamba. What's happening everyone? Dingo here. We're on a snake call out. I've been at the beach. Look at me. I still got sand on my feet. I'm on the beach having a chill out. Got a call. Snake inside this laundry room. Don't know what it is. They said it's big. So I'm gonna go glasses first to make sure not a spinning cobra coming over here. Uh, they haven't given me any details about where it is. It's always interesting. Walking into a room like this. Oh, something dropped out. It was a leap. Walking into a room like this, not knowing where it can be in the room. There's not that many places. My guess is probably underneath here. Um, I'm taking this off. I can't see properly, it's too dark. My arm touched that there. I pooped myself. No, nothing here. Nothing there. Let's get this out the way. Um, I'm going to lift it up. Just check out underneath. Tell me if you see something. Now, sorry to interrupt the video, but I have to tell you about an opportunity to join me here in Africa working with the animals that you're seeing and a whole bunch of others in December and January. Now, 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 coming up in a month or two's time on our volunteer program. Send an email bookings at dingowild.com and we'll send you all the information. Woohoo! Come and join me in Africa. Back to the video. No. Yeah. Are you sure? Can you see under? Look right under. If it's a small snake, this is the problem we have. Everyone says, oh, big snake, big snake. So I've been told it's like this big and like that fat, which is normally this fat and this big. And it's normally like a brown house snake or something non-venomous. Can you see, have you seen underneath properly? Well, this is the best place for a snake. This is too hard. Can you see anything? I can't see anything. This is probably the snake. It's the hose pump snake, the garden hose snake. That always makes an excellent snake for people. So hose pops, great snake. Look at oh, it's a monster snake. There's probably no snake here. I've come off the beach just to cruise around and not see any snakes. No snake, no snake. Now most of the time, when you're looking for snakes, you're actually just going through people's people's stuff. Ah, come, 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 snake. <laughs> There's a snake! It's in between there. Can you see it? There's a snake and it's a black mamba. We've got black mamba! <laughs> it's worth coming off the beach all of a sudden. We've got black mamba in here and it's behind all the paint cans. Now, this has become an interesting morning. Oh, there it is. Look at it. I don't think it's a monster black mamba, but a black mamba is a black mamba. Doesn't matter the size, it's still gonna bite you. I don't have tongs here to grab it. I'm going prepared for this. Always carry a hook in my car. Here we go. It's sleeping. We're lucky it's sleeping. Oh, oh, look at that. It's longer than I thought. Still nice and cool. Okay, you're gonna need to back up, back up, back up. I'm gonna bring it out. Here we go. It's just waking up now. Here we go. Look at it. Hello. Oh, there's a flash of the mouth. Hello, are you waking up now? Good looking. Okay. Is it, this is a really. Flashing its mouth at me now. This is a really dangerous size to have a, as a to handle as a black mamba. It's not massive. It's about a, I would say I'm six foot. This here is probably about, I don't know, about eight foot, I reckon. And uh, when it gets to this size, these snakes can get right up in the 14 foot mark. When it gets to this size here, they are whippy because they are still light. So you can move. Ah, ah, ah. He's gaping right at me there. They can move super, super quickly. Isn't that amazing? Look at the snake, the black mamba. I ah, don't look. Look at him, look at me here. Look at that gaping, look at that gaping mouth. Oh, he's trying to get my hand. Look at that. This is it, face to fang with the most notorious snake found anywhere in the world. Look at him. Oh, he is super twitchy. Look at that. The problem we have now is he's woken up. Early on, he hadn't woken up. Okay. Oh, girl. Right, come on, come on, come on. I just need to get him. He's trying to duck away. I need to get him in a position where I can get hold of him quickly. All right, up you go, up you go, up you go. Okay, let's see if we can back him up now. Back up, back up, back up. Normally, I wouldn't be using a hook stick for this. Here we go, we got him. Whoa! Mamba, you can 
see, some people might think there that those aren't fangs, that it's, he's been defanged or something. That is not the case. Let me show you. I have to be careful now. Can you see his fangs? That doesn't hurt him. I'm just lifting up that front nose scale there. And he's got sheets that protect those fangs. How's that face? Imagine having a black mom in your laundry. This is not the kind of snake you want to have in your laundry. Look here, he's got me. He's got me as like I've got a surf leash. This is just made my whole time away. How awesome is this? Going away to the beach this morning, swimming in the sea, and now Black Mamba. It's hot and humid in here. We're gonna go and release him now. How awesome is this snake here, the Black Mamba? Woohoo! This is what I live for. See you next time. Dingo out.